Our Android Cloud Network Media Player with live input allows you to display a live feed, such as a TV feed from a set-top box, alongside your other digital signage content. The following example shows how to connect your TV set-top box to the media player, and then the media player to your screen via HDMI. Begin by inserting the power cable into your media player and powering it on from the mains. There is no on-off power switch on the player so it should power up automatically. Then connect your TV set-top box to the media player via HDMI. Insert one end of the HDMI cable into the TV box, then the other end into the HDMI in input on the media player. Next, connect the player to your existing screen via HDMI. Insert one end of a second HDMI cable into the HDMI out port of the media player, then the other end into the HDMI input of your screen. You should then see something that looks like this. Once you've connected your media player to the internet, you can then update it and change the layout of your content. To adjust your live input zone on the CMS, begin by creating a new user template. Then select the Picture in Picture or PIP tool and set the size and shape of your live TV feed. Once you have finished adding all of your other zones to the template, create your playlist and publish it to your screen. It really is that easy to integrate your TV feed with the rest of your digital signage content.